Welcome to the Boxing Bookie. We are here with a different background because we're in a remote location. We are not in Fort Worth, Texas. Uh, we're with some family in New York for Christmas. We're going to do the next two shows from here, and then I'll be back uh, in Fort Worth with the Texas-themed background. Uh, but we want to get into today's show. Uh, we got a good one for you today. Heavyweight Clash on December 23rd. We're going to break that down. I'll show you exactly how to make money on Deontay Wilder. Uh, versus Joseph Parker, but before we do, please like, share, and subscribe. Follow 3D Boxing, 3D Boxing Blog, or all forms of social media. Uh, the Boxing Bookie comes at you for every single major fight, uh, showing you how to bring down the house. We don't gamble here, but if you do, I'm going to show you how to make a second stream of income. Um, also, we use DraftKings. You can't even use DraftKings in Texas, uh, but if you, you know, so we don't gamble, but if you do, I'm going to show you how to uh, consistently make money, bring down the house. The odds makers, the bookies, they don't know what they're doing. I do. I'm going to show you how to make that money. Also, please subscribe to our other channel, Texas Boxing Scene, on YouTube. That is Texas Boxing Scene. All proceeds go to autism research and recovery. All right, so let's get into today's show. And I'm sorry if this sounds bad. I don't have my typical equipment, um, so we're just going to make the best of it. Um, all right, let's get into today's show. Um, Deontay Wilder has been inactive. Um He's only fought twice since the Fury fight. I'm sure he's only fought once since the Fury fight. Um, it was last year. Um, he got a first round knockout, so it's only been one round um, since uh, in the last two plus years, um, 26 months or so since the third Fury fight. He's just fought the one round. His fights often end quickly, um, you know, and we know. Sorry, we know what Deontay Wilder is. He's a, he's a knockout artist. He's patient, he's powerful, uh, and he usually gets his man out. He's gotten everyone out except for Tyson Fury. And he, in three fights with Tyson Fury, um, he's knocked him out. He's knocked him down four times. So uh, he did everything but knock Fury out. Um, he's knocked him down four times in, in three fights. Um, he's got, and outside of that, you know, besides the three Fury fights, his first. Uh, before his three other fights, he's got a first round knockout and seventh round knockout against Ortiz and a first round knockout against Hellenius. So that's where we are with uh, Deontay Wilder. Um, we go back, it's been almost four years since the second fight, and he's fought just twice since then. Um, he fought, he fought, you know, Fury in February 2022, uh, sorry, February 22nd, 2020. Um, knocked got knocked out. That was the fight he got beat down badly in right before the pandemic. Uh, then he was out of the ring for a year and a half, came back and fought Fury, uh, lost in 11. Uh, then he came back a year later and uh, knocked Helenius out in the first round. And, and here we are from here. So he hasn't been active. Um, you know, he, 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 we know what it is. It's, it's can he land the right hand? If he can, it, it's good night. Um, and so far, if he can't, he, he's probably not going to win. Um, but this is a fight that I, I think plays really well for him. Um, he's old, uh, but he doesn't have a high work rate, right? Right? Like he's not a big volume punch. So I, I don't expect much to change with with Wilder. I expect him to be able to compete and basically do what he's done. He's got a great chin. Yeah, he's defensively poor. Um, I want to see what he comes in and weighs at. I don't really like him at 230. I think he's less athletic. I think he's less mobile at 230. I like him at 215, 220. I think that's a better weight for him. I'd like to see where he comes in at, so I'm interested in seeing that. And uh, we'll, we'll get to see that shortly. Um, you know, can he set up the one shot? And that is basically all he's looking to do is, is get that right hand home. Um, fortunately for him, he's fighting a guy, um, Joseph Parker, who likes to fight at range. He likes, he likes to create distance, and he carries his lead hand low. So he lines up perfectly to get nailed with that right hand. right? Like, um, you know, we, we look at Joseph Parker. He's got a heavy jab. He's fairly athletic for a guy his size. He's got good hand speed for a guy that size. Uh, he doesn't carry a lot of power. He gets hit a lot. He gets hit a lot. He lunges in on his right hands. When he throws his back hand, he lunges in on it. I just think he's going to get caught. He's going to get caught sooner rather than later. Um, so I, I don't think this is a great fight stylistically. Like I said, you got a guy 
Um, you know, look, uh, Eric Molina, well, people showed this, right? Eric Molina gave, I don't want to say trouble, but he had a moment of success and he, and he hurt Wilder. Wilder's power is at the end of his punches. So you want to cut it off when you get on the inside. So you got to get on the inside. This is a guy in park who likes to be on the outside. He likes that. He likes to create distance. I you know he likes to throw combinations from the outside. And he throws decent combinations, and he carries his lead hand low. I just don't see. And he, he gets hit quite a bit. Like it only takes one with this guy. Like like he's absolutely correct. And when he says you have to be perfect for thirty six minutes, I just have to be perfect for you know five seconds or whatever he says. He just needs to throw the one shot. Um, you know he's a guy that's willing to go backwards. He can you know he'll, he'll go backwards. I just think eventually. You know, it could be in the first round, it could be in the fifth round, but he's going to get nailed with a right hand. Um, this guy who I think gets posterized. I, I think we see Joseph Parker, and you know, maybe he has some success for a round or two or three or four, but eventually he's going to get stopped and he's going to get posterized. You know, he guesses out too; like he does guess out. Um, so I, I don't think he goes that long into the fight because, like I said, he's too flawed. He's not a terrible heavyweight. He's a decent heavyweight. He was heavyweight champ, so he's good. You know, he's not a bum. He's not like Wallace fight a bum. It's just stylistically, he he walks right into Wallace's right hand. And I don't see this going any other way. Um, you know, he's not lightning fast foot wise. He's got decent hand speed, but his feet are not lightning fast. So he's not like you know he's going to circle, circle, circle and, and confuse Wilder and frustrate him. That's not going to happen. Um, Carrying that lead hand low with Wilder and trying, you know, trying to be at range and keeping your lead hand low with Wilder is a is recipe for disaster. So I, I think Wilder gets him out. Um, now let's let's look at the odds on this. I'll share it with y'all. Take a look. Here's what I'm looking at. That's what I want. Mm-hmm. All right, so. Wilder is minus 650, but we're going to take a two times bet on Wilder. Uh, Wilder will win. Uh, a $200 bet makes us $30.76. Wilder by KO on a one time bet makes us $25. You can actually make that a two time bet. I'm not. Uh, I'm going to make, you know, uh, this is Wilder wins, uh, but he's certainly going to win by knockout, I would think. So you can make that a two times bet if you want. Um, that would make you $30. Uh, fifty-five dollars, and then to go under six and a half because I, I do think he'll, he'll knock him out within five, much less six and a half. So that's going to make you ninety, uh, one fifteen, twenty-five, thirty-five, forty-five. So that's going to make you one hundred forty-five dollars on a four hundred dollar bet. So you know you bring these odds down, you know you're getting about one to three odds about Wilder knocks him out within six rounds. You know, this is not a great bet. You know, it, it's not, but it is what it is. You know, I, I think everyone would agree with me that Wilder is going to knock him out. Wilder is going to stop him. Parker fights into his hands. And again, it's not that Parker is a terrible heavyweight. Like, honestly, like Parker may be the second best heavyweight he's ever beaten. Honestly, like he's not bad. It's just he's going to walk. Besides Ortiz, um, give me a better heavyweight that Wilder has beaten other than Parker, better than Parker. So, again, I, I don't think Parker's bad, and, and, and you, we can make a big deal about Wilder's age if we want. He is, I think he's 37 or 38, so he's getting up there. I'm going to be interested to see his weight. Um, but ultimately, I, I think we get Wilder by knockout within five rounds. And we're giving six and a half on this bet, so I, I really like that. So I'm taking Wilder on the under and Wilder by knockout. So, um, again, that's going to make us – a uh, two times bet on Wilder, make us 30, 25, that's 55, $145 on a four dollar bet. So it's not terrible odds. It's not, it's not, you know, not having a better fortune to make a little bit. Um, you know, it's, it's basically about three times. Let me know what you guys think. Leave your thoughts, comments below. Please like, share, and subscribe. Follow the boxing book in all forms of social media. Uh, the boxing book comes at you for every single major fight. If this fight you want me to break down, I'm going to do it anyway into Paula's uh, the next day or two. I'll watch some footage on that. But let me know what you guys think. Leave your thoughts, comments below. Please like, share, and subscribe. Follow the boxing book in all forms of social media. Also, follow me on Texas Boxing Scene. Uh, all proceeds from that channel go to Autism Research and Recovery. It is December 22nd, 2023, from Texas to the world. 
Thank you and God bless. Don't miss a tweet, post, story, or video. 3D Boxing is on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Hit the subscribe button now to stay inside the ring.